Hello, I'm Dr Ruth Williams, a consultant children's neurologist at the Evelina London Children's Hospital. I also work as a medical examiner based at St Thomas's and cover the boroughs of Lambeth and Southwark, which have a combined population of approximately 650,000. Medical examiners are senior doctors from a range of specialties who work independently of hospitals and other healthcare providers. We review the medical records of those who've died which do not require coronial investigation and where we're not involved in the care. We come to our own conclusion about the cause of death. We then discuss the treating team's proposed cause of death with them and may advise on referral to the coroner or wording of the MCCD, the Medical Certificate of Cause of Death also commonly known as the death certificate. Most importantly, we then contact the deceased next of kin. The legislation followed a number of inquiries and reviews, including the Shipman Inquiry in 2007. Currently, and up until September the 9th, the doctor responsible for a patient's care during their final illness completes the MCCD. Registrars check the MCCD and if the family provide additional information meeting criteria for referral can raise their concerns directly to the coroner. The Shipman inquiry concluded that this system did not provide adequate safeguards against the rare possibility that the doctor completing the MCCD was also responsible in some way for a patient's death. The new legislation becomes statutory on the 9th of September 2024. All deaths not referred to a coroner must now be scrutinised by a medical examiner and the cause of death agreed. New MCCDs will be signed by the medical examiner to confirm that such scrutiny has taken place. The medical examiner will liaise with families to ensure that any concerns they may have are raised appropriately. Any doctor who has treated the patient at any time will be able to complete the MCCD if they are able to propose a cause of death to the best of their knowledge and belief, and there is no requirement for coronial referral.